And obviously later today the House will uh, be voting on the American Health Care Act. Uh, the current vote is scheduled for 3.30. The President has been working the phones and having in-person meetings since the American Health Care Act was introduced. He's left everything on the field when it comes to this bill. The President and Congressional Republicans promised the American people that they would repeal and replace this broken system. Obamacare's Washington-driven, one-size-fits-all plan had seven years to prove its case. And look what it's left us with. Um, the President understands this is it. We had this opportunity uh, to, to change uh, the trajectory of health care to help improve, a, put a health care system in place and to end the nightmare that Republicans have campaigned on called Obamacare. I noted yesterday it was the seventh year anniversary of Obamacare. We have an opportunity to make sure that was the last one and the question is uh, do members realize this opportunity? Make no mistake about it, I mean the President made it clear last night, this is it. You know, you have an opportunity to do what you've told the American people, the commitment that we as a party have made. Um, but this is your chance to do what we've done. We've listened, we've incorporated, we've updated um, in every way possible. I don't think, when you look at legislative efforts, I think the President has given it his all. Um, and I think it shocked a lot of people, frankly, uh, how very, very detail-oriented, how uh, personal it was for him calling members, you know, as early as 6 in the morning, going to 11 o'clock at night, the last several nights. Um, sitting down, meeting after meeting with them, coming back and revising it, having his team back and forth. Um, everything's out there. But is the President comfortable then with Obamacare continuing? And what is he No, saying? he's is not. I mean, of course he's not. With a promise that he would repeal this. I, I mean, I'm not even sure where to start with that. No, he's not, which is why he's literally put as much effort as he has into repealing this. Um, and, and so, but he's made it clear that this is our moment. This is our opportunity to do it. Um, but it is now up to members to make that decision whether or not they want to be part of this effort to repeal Obamacare. And if they don't, and I think for a lot of the, the you know, you saw the President's tweet this morning, I think for a lot of these members who, who life is an important issue as well, this is your opportunity. Um,